So let us respect each other. Ah. <laughs> ni mwambie let us respect each other. Okay, amekwama kwa nini? Amekwama anasema hatoki nifanye kitu nafanya. Ucheze kama wewe. Na maybe yeye alikuwa anataka nicheze kama mimi. Nikamwambia hapana utatoka kwa gari. Nilipiga simu kwa hiyo best yake hapa kiwa hapo tu hapo hapo ndani. Taxi problems. Wampo is your boy the chairman of Gadi Top Oga Obina. Welcome to Obina TV and another episode of Taxi problems you can see the t-shirt right over there all right this episode i sit down with taxi drivers and taxi passengers we get to talk about the situations we've been in so that other people can be aware we're just trying to advocate and push for safer commuting communities all right so for this particular episode niko na beshtangu hapa mambo poa sana naitwa mimi jemo jemo kuendesha dio sasa kazi ndio kazi yangu hiyo umesukuma miaka ngapi hivi eh nilianza na gym club mhm kama miaka miwili hivi mhm mm nikatoka hapo uba ilipoanza si ndio madereva kwanza tulianza tulitoka gym club tuka join uba mhm mm na tulipo join uba tulifanyishwa tests na zilikuwa ukifanya test kwa online those through those pads zao na kwa nazo ma ipad pass ilikuwa ukipata na, ukipata 90% wewe unapita okay and by the virtue of the experiences that tumbad kwa nazo huko huko kwa nini nilipita kuna nyingine ndio walianguka ndio napata 20 hata 20 40 wanaambia you don't qualify because okay. walikuwa wanapima city knowledge yako eh eh umesema umepitia ma problem mashodi eh kabisa kabisa eh uh -huh. what happened it was uh, nilikuwa nimeenda kuachukua mahali kulikuwa na 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 party so walikuwa ndako kwenda hapo kari request mimi nikaenda kuachukua walikuwa ni ngapi hivi nilikuwa ni masaa 8 za usiku una working usiku? Mimi nafanya kazi ya usiku kwanza nainamisha sana sababu hiyo kazi ya usiku inaga mambo ya jam, traffic. Oh, una avoid mambo ya traffic. Yeah. So uh, uh, trips zako kieno na trip za faster faster. Okay. Yes. So amekuita sana nane usiku. Ulikuwa wapi wewe? Nilikuwa upande za Thika Road. Nikaita upande za Modaiga na huko. Eh. Kutoka huko all the way. Yeah, nikaenda huko. Sina job. I'm a mm -hmm. request. Mhm. Uh -huh. yeah. Kaishia. Nikaishia mimi. Mhm. Mm na mm, tulipo nilipoenda nilipata mademo wawili nikawapiga simu nikauliza kawaida wakirequest mimi nawapigaga simu mko wapi toka mahali fulani so nikamwambia nikuje ama ama nyinyi ndio mtakuja mahali niko because kulikuwa kumejaa wakaniambia acha tuje mahali huko nika park kwa stage uko na chukua wapi hapo golf club oh hmm. okay nikawachukua wakanikawapigia wakaniambia we park gari hapo tunakuja walirudi wakakuja wakakaa wawili wakiwa nyuma na hapo walikuwa maji mbaya wamekunywa wamekunywa imeshika Am, imeshika nare eh so nikaambia sasa tunaenda wapi ukasema tunaenda moja tu na huko lavi mwingine ande na huko pande za kitu suru okay nikaambia sawa twende akaniambia sasa lakini tuna stop overs ya kwanza itakuwa ni lavi alafu yengine na kitu suru nami tukaenda na wao but the, the way they were commenting unasikia moja anasema aliambia hey And this dude looks like to be a good guy. <laughs> He's a handsome guy. Wewe mwingine anasema huyu jamaa anaweza katuibia. Na sasa hata mimi siko kwa hizo wanasema. Mimi niko shughuli, si niko kwa job. Mimi niko hapa kuwapatia service. Wewe unaendesha tu mashini? Eh, mimi naendesha mashini. Hiyo ndio job, hiyo ndio job yangu na kuliaga hapo. Yeah. Watoi wangu wanashibaga hii. Eh. Wewe ni bamba. This guy seems to be hunt me. Eh. We tunapitiaga it's normal. It's oh, not. Wewe umeshinda una complimenti watu na watu. Una wata compliment lakini wewe unajua una ushughuli na wao. Okay. Wako janta yako. Hmm. Sio wametoka happy zao. Yaani eh. wapeleke kula naenda. You have to be friendly. Wakiingia wakiwa friendly mimi nakuwa friendly. Akiingia manyamaza na nyamaza sababu juu mood za mtu vile yuko. Yeah. Doing it professionally. So, kabeba, nikabeba na tukaenda na nika drop hiyo kwanza na wa pili tukawachana. So between na kwanza na pili nani mwenye alikuwa amekula like sana? Eh huyo huyo wa pili ndiye alikuwa na eh anasema vitu mbao anasema eh hey, huyu jamaa yuko sana. Venye ulisha drop mwingine la visiko kama kinao mwingine. Mm. What happened alikwambia nini? Ah kuna yet na tutukiongea tu vitu za kawaida normal lakini alikuwa ni mtu so friendly na mtu ana open up na anambia life has challenges. Uh -huh. And we take life the way things are. All right. He, he she, alikuwa very positive very positive oh uh, alafu 
Ah mimi chukua namba. Ah si kuchukua namba. Oh just so ni client. Kulikuwa na kulipa aje. Huyo ni client wangu. Nimwambia lipe kwa 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 kwa, kwa paybill. Kwa pochi. <laughs> kwa pochi eh. <yeah. laughs> Hautaki story nyingi. Us, ah. Usiende ukasetiwa. Na ukawacha na ikaenda hivyo. Ah we. Shughuli yangu ni, kugo, ni, ni kugonya mtu wangu. Eh? So mambo zingine za kusema ati oh what is stories zikawa hapana. Hapo mm. kazi kazi ni hii. Okay. okay. Ukisha deliver wewe una, unasema inshallah kwamba Mungu amefanya nini? Amenifanikisha. Amenifanikisha. Na nimepata kitu yangu ya kula na watoto waende shule na, na wale vizuri. So wale mademu wamesema we ni ni mahantan mademu wangapi hivi? Oh, they comment. Unajua kitu kizuri kinaonekanaga. <laughs> na kitu kibaya kizuri kinajiuza kibaya kinajitembeza. Ama si ama si kweli. <laughs> kama ujiamini was a person. Eh. Hey, eh. Uh-huh. Kama ujiamini it's all about confidence. The way you carry yourself, mm. I know how I am. How I'm fearfully created eh? and wonderfully made of God. Yes. So ujaipata mtu kwa taxi. Wako hata wengine wako misbehave. Unapata mtu anakuja na kaapa mbele. Kuna siku nilibeba lawyer akakaa hapa mbele na nimeelewa nika na ame request hiyo na best yake. Nimemtoa hapa vineyard hii hapa tu. Nikama mimi unaniachi unaniachiaje wewe? Wewe ni number request unanipatiaje je demu? Itakuwaje? Ananiambia hapana usijali, huyu atakulipa ana pesa ni mtu wako nazo usijali. Na asipokulipa sina namba yangu nipigie. We nani? Eh. Nayo nayo. Ma mimi nikampeleka. Tulipofika, kamwambia shuka tumeshafika. Akatilia kwa gari. Kwanza ile kama ameka miguu huku juu. Kwa dashboard. Na ni lawyer demu. Eh ameka hapa kwa maji mbaya. Ameka mguu hapa. Hapo mbele. Gai. Na una imagine huko mwingine anakaa je? But wewe sababu shughuli zako huko huko, wewe fikisha mtu kule anaenda, pata kile unapata, aenda zake. Hadi kwa mia kwa gari. Hiyo lawyer. Hata tulipofika eh, akasema I'm not I'm not going off. Why? I'm not stepping up. Namwambia listen. Kanambia do you know who I am? Kanambia listen. Me I don't know who you are, even you don't know me who I am. So let us respect each other. Ah. <laughs> Nimwambia let us respect each other. Okay, amekwama kwa nini? Amekwama anasema hatoki, nifanye kitu nafanya. Ucheze kama wewe. Na maybe hiyo nilikuwa nataka nicheze kama mimi. Nikamwambia hapana utatoka kwa gari. Nilipiga simu kwa hiyo best yake hapa, kio hapo tu hapo hapo ndani. Nikamwambia, "Hey bro, nilikuambiaje huyo mtu nilichukua ulinipatia hata anza kunisua." Ama nisumbua amekaranda kwa gari. Na zile vitu analeta ni mambo za obvious na stacki mimi. So nini nilifanya kashuka? Final niambia wewe jamaa akasema atakuja kum, kum, uh, kumchukua kampigia sima kama mimi nini wewe unasumbua wewe dere si umulipe ama uniambie ni mulipe mmaliza na yeye <laughs> akachomoka akakaa tu akafanya kuwa moyo mgumu akakaa tu hapo nikamwambia hey bro i spend almost like an hour nikijaribu kumwambia atoke kwa gari alitokaje what what made her leave ah aliongelesha na huyo best yake ambaye alikuwa mama mlikwasti alikuwa best boy ama dem boy Hmm. Kanambia chapa ana shida. Kama ni chapa yote utataka atakulipa. Huyu ni mtu anazo. Au ni pamwambia mambo ya price akaniambia hey, unajua hiyo price hiyo vile ilikuwa. Nikamwambia what do you expect umestay time yote tumekaa hivi. Price wewe ni ile ile. True, true. So you, you, it, it lazima hiyo hiyo price lazima ishonge. Akasema silipi. Nikamwambia sasa ulipi na umeshabebwa. Ai. Eh. Wewe una ma complication. Mambo ni mawili nikupeleke karao ama nikurudishe bali nimekutoa. I don't mind. Ndamo nimechoma, nimechoma. Swali so, lipa. Finally aliongelesha na best yake akalipa. Akasema I'm going to report to the Uber. Nami nika report immediately kwa Uber. Nimebeba client yuko hivi na amenisumbua sana. Hii ndio ile time nimespend na yeye. Amenizuia nisende kufanya kazi nyingi na ikaishi hapo. We? <laughs> Haya. You had the story by yourself from the horse's mouth. Huku nje mambo inachemuka gai. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys on the next episode. Remember to like, comment and subscribe. And if you have another story, it might be strange, might be interesting, might be unique, might be weird, might be funny as hell. Send me an email tvobina@gmail.com. I look for you will shoot it so that we can create safer commuting communities. See you on the next one. How you doing? This is Taxi Problems. In case you know anybody who's gone through taxi problems, either a driver or a passenger, tell them talk to me. Then we can let them talk to you so they share with you our brothers and sisters so we have a safer and more sana commuting community all right watch like subscribe and tell a friend to tell a friend